everybody, welcome back. Today I am bringing you a 12 minute full body hit circuit with some weights. So today I'm using a set of 10 pound dumbbells. You don't want anything too light or too heavy today, something in the mid range for yourself. And as always, you can always use household objects if you don't have dumbbells available to you right now at home. So the way that today's workout is structured is we have six different exercises. Each of the exercises are going to be 40 seconds on with a 20 second rest. And we're gonna do two rounds and that will bring us to 12 minutes. So make sure you've got your weights ready to go. You have something soft beneath you and you can see your screen so you can follow along with me. And without further ado, let's get to it. All right guys, first up, grabbing your dumbbells. You're going to do a swing. Your dumbbells are together. They come all the way up to here, to your shoulders. Squat, shoulder press. Press and down. Hinge and press. So really squeeze those glutes at the top of that swing. Hinge on the hips, squeeze. Press, these are nice explosive movements. Make sure you're not locking those elbows at the top. Next up, we're doing an alternating oblique crunch. So two on one side, one, two, extend, and switch. Two, one, two, extend, and switch. You want to focus on exhaling as you're doing that crunch. Again, nice explosive movements. Here we go. We're just doing an alternating back row. 
So leaning forward, nice flat back. Squeezing, driving the elbow backwards. Squeezing the back. One, two, switch, and switch. Try to put your body weight into your heels. That will relieve a little bit of pressure off your lower back. Squeeze those lats. Nice job, guys. All right, last exercise. All you need is one weight or two, again, depending on how heavy your weights are. Squat, curl, come up, curl. As simple as that, I want you to focus on form. Keep those elbows locked all the way down into a squat. Here we go. Down, curl, upper body is lifted. We're pressing through those heels and squeezing those glutes. Don't let those knees cave inward as you stand up. Press through those heels. into round number two, starting off with that swing. Dumbbells come to your shoulders. Really make sure you're not locking that elbow out at the top. You wanna to keep a slight bend in it. If you're locking it, you're gonna injure yourself. So make sure you don't do that. Swing it up to the shoulders, down into a deep squat. Press, down, press, and lower. Hinge, squeeze those glutes. Be limp. Here we go.
Alright guys. Next up is our reverse lunge with our tricep extension. So again, make sure you're locking those elbows as you come down. They're not coming too far back and they're not staying too far forward. Lock them and keep them straight. Here we go. back rows next. Nice and simple. Keep a flat back. Weight shifted into those heels. Let's go. Squeeze that back, drive those elbows backward. Here we go. Down. Curl. Lock those elbows. Sit into those heels. Okay, it's almost there. minute full body workout. This is a great little circuit that's short, sweet, simple. It's going to get your heart rate up and it's going to get a good sweat going. So there's no excuses. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, give it a thumbs up for me. Leave me your feedback down below. That's how I know that you liked or didn't like this video and it helps me with feedback for future videos. If you're new here, make sure that you hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another video from me. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.